Hey everybody, today's video is just going to be a look back over the 164 videos that I've produced. Uh, there's been a lot of them, they range from various things, reviews, um, how to's, do it yourselves. Uh, tried to include a little bit of uh, everything, odd, different things. Uh, it's just to give you a look at what uh, the channel is about, how we've come from the last three years. We're right at 901 subscribers at the uh, taping of this. And I want to give some people that maybe don't know about the channel, show them what I do and maybe they'll subscribe. I'm really trying to get to that thousand subscribers. If you can help me out, leave a comment, share, share the videos, please. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. I really appreciate it. So let's get on with the video. Let's look at the last three years, 164 videos. And look at yours. This one just requires a little bit of pressure. Hold the fan, give it a little bit of pressure on the plastic and this little lens piece will come out. Now, we'll see the little lens piece after the lens. All right, the bolt that we want to take out is a nine millimeter or 11 32nd. So let's uh, see if this 11 32nd will work. And I'm, try I'm gonna try to get you a shot of this. It's not going to work. So we're doing a test run on the on the play area today, and it seems to be working out really well. So far, they enjoy being outside. Now they're watching their mobile. They love to watch that thing out here. They really like to be outside. There's a difference. I don't know. Pretty cool. And it's a good thing because I plan on having them out a lot this summer while I'm doing work. So, so far so good. found the blades they we took them to a mower shop fortunately we have a mower shop that's close and so we went straight to the mower shop and they just took the blades and matched them up for us that's the best way to do it if you have a shop around uh, so the new blades are here and they're pretty and they're straight and that's what they're supposed to look like and the ones that were on there were really bad, so we're going to get these blades back on there. Okay, here we are. I had to really pump some light into this area got the wall up and that really
20 minutes out. Really boring ride, but an hour and 20 minutes will be there. Knock on wood, truck's running good. I don't know about the fuel mileage. It seems to be doing good. Uh, not many people on the roads today, so it's a decent ride as far as that goes. Just a really boring ride, this particular road that I'm on. It's just really wretched. So, about an hour and 20 minutes, we should be there. So, here we go. install this floor because they will be coming back they would never be finished with this job it would never be finished uh, once again my opinion don't install this floor don't attempt it don't buy it don't purchase it terrible terrible floor Okay, working on something a little different today. We got some little raised beds here, little garden beds. We're gonna put some PVC piping across them, make some wings, cover it in plastic, make some little, uh, I guess, winter, little winter tunnels for. on the wheelchair ramp project. Um, I'm getting a late start today. I had some things to do this morning, but I did pick up a bunch of materials, so I have plenty of wood to work with. Um, I only have two more 4x4 posts to install, and that'll be the last of the posts. So things are moving right along. I'll be installing the uh, 2x6 stringers today, and I've been cutting the decking. Um, so things are moving right along. 
and it's starting to get warm so let's get to it. Okay, today's starting a new project. We are patching a hole that has been patched several times before. There's a leak overhead. All right, I'm excited. I voted. Been waiting to vote for many years. I'm glad to be able to do it. This election is so important. Um, charged up about being able to cast my boat, try to make a change. that piece outside in the garbage so got so hot it was damn near smoking now it says recording again Jesus. I don't know. we'll leave it running there and see what it does evidently What I found was I had no issues connecting. Uh, with the other cameras, the regular cameras without the um, antenna, that's why I put the extender out there because they just didn't have enough signal to get back into the house. Um, this uh, system... I Okay, so we're about eight weeks in on the Makita um, back. Okay, so I have three of the four floors. I have examples here, and these are, these are pieces that I've had left. And what I do when I finish um, putting these uh, floors down in my, in my house, I try to always keep enough to make any repairs. <laughs> Okay, so now that's all, all that is waiting, I have the bolts off and we are ready. 
We now we have the bolts off, have the cameras adjusted, and we are ready to lift this toilet out. Now I'm gonna lift. Now we're recording. See if the gimbal can keep going or if it's gonna overheat on us again. But there we are. That's the shot we're getting. That's the wax ring in place, and I'm hoping that's enough of a wax ring. I'm hoping it's high enough. Okay, we're now filling it up with water. Looking for leaks again. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed looking back over the last three years of my channel. And maybe you learned something. Maybe you're interested and you want to subscribe. Uh, if you subscribe and hit that uh, bell icon, you'll be notified when I have new content that becomes available. And remember, they may do it another way, but that's the way I do it. I'll see you next time.